and gentlemen, we are standing at the sand to Dubai now. We are to uh, 20,000 feet to be with Dubai within 10 minutes. Thank you. Projectors, as you can see, so I was able to achieve with two projectors uh, 180. As you can see, all around it's exactly 180 degrees. Uh, a, a lot of a lot of fellow simmers use uh, three projectors to 180. Uh, I was able to do it with only two projectors with no problems whatsoever. The morphine software and uh, the blending and everything is uh, from flight and ease, it works charm and I just love it. And there you go, very immersive, full surround, 
I'm going to show you from the other side. There you go, that's one side. And that's the other side. Okay, so that's as far as the projectors are concerned. As you can see, there you go, two of them. Now, of course, uh, the outside hasn't changed much of the simulator. I guess the uh, biggest add-on, as far as hardware-wise, is this beast right here. I built myself a totally new computer. It's a powerhouse. There you go. Of course, I own a computer store, so that's no big for me. I can do whatever I like. Uh, I added sound system. It's a 4.1, very nice. I added a butt shaker that adds a lot. I mean that you can you can feel the bumps on the runway, you can feel when the gear, landing gear goes up, it really adds a lot uh, to the experience. Uh, and that's as far as the outside is concerned. Okay? So now the inside or the cabin itself I should say, the biggest change was a, I enclosed the rear of the cabin so of course it's not the proper length it should be another probably four or five feet back I don't have the room of course because I have a wall here but just the addition of the door and the extension of about a foot foot and a half of the cabin the back of the cabin really adds a lot I mean not only it looks really amazing but also it adds to the feel of being enclosed inside and even it sounds better than just an all around better experience. Okay, so there you go. So we're gonna go inside. And this is the door. And now we get inside here. And of course, this is my beautiful cockpit right here, very proud of it. There you go. amazing and of course here now because of the, the back wall I added as you can see now here we have we have a we can hang our uniform and you know extras embellishments there you go that's the other side it's a uniform now this hole right here very important being closed in now can get very hot in here so I actually added I will show you I added a fan and this fan is extremely important it's just a $20 bathroom fan but it's extremely important it adds fresh air and deep inside through the hole right there and you believe me you really need it it gets really hot in here Okay, so that's my beautiful carpet right there, and there you go. Nothing has changed as far as avionics. Oh yes, I added a few components. I added, there you go. I added uh, transponder, radios. Uh, so uh, very useful. But as far as the rest is concerned, it's pretty well what you saw in the flight bag. Yes, I'm really enjoying my cockpit. It just looks beautiful. I made a, I don't know if you saw it in the previous video, but I made a headrests for both seats. Right and left. And the rest is uh, pretty well the same as before. I just want to show you guys if you like it and the Nick comments ask questions 